Alan, congratulations. Uh, again, just uh, what when you found out, when, when you walk into that training room, what was going through your head uh, when they told you that you had won the award? Yes. Uh, thank you, thank you for for this. I am very happy. I am excited because this is very, very good team for me. About like my last year, and when I was injury, and I passed like difficult moments in, in my life. So now I am I am I am very very happy, you know. But this is this is for not only for me. This is for all the team, for all the players. They support me, all the, the people like working here in, in, in the facility, in the club, the coaches, the, the physios, the more important, and the doctors also. So I am I am very happy and uh, and I remember last year and how hard is is for me this injury, my first in my career, so now I enjoy it a lot and I am proud about me and, and, and all the people uh, stay stay with me in this position. Just how much work did you have to put in to, to to get yourself back, even to just playing and not 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 just even at like the highest level? No, it's a lot of work. It's a lot of training. It's a lot a, a good mentality. And I remember after my surgery, my my first thing when I make to do is uh, I go to the preseason with the team and I start to. And I started to 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 train, you know, to the therapy. Of course, I, I am in, with crashes and I can move a lot, but I I stay with the team in preseason in Arizona and uh, and immediately I start to to do, to my recovery, you know, and, and and I don't take like holidays, I don't take like days because uh, I I want to make in this position, I want to my, I want to come back like soon, and, and this is this is the this is the result for for work hard for. For I put like all my hair in about the soccer and and, and the sporting, and and then, I, I don't know. This is this is the the very good thing. I am very happy, but of course it's work and and it's good mentality and uh, and it's always I, I want to to work up. You know. Alan, uh, in español y en inglés, uh, siempre crees este es posible o uh, Algunas veces, cuando no crees este es posible. Did you always think this was possible, or were there times when you did not think this was possible? No, yes. For me, my mind is always is possible. Uh, uh, depends, no. In this work, he have like a lot of responsibilities because because you need to work first. You need to 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 stay like positive, and uh, you need to to dreams like I don't know in the sky. And and of course uh, you need to you need to be like happy, you no? Know, always. Sometimes these injuries is, is difficult because you think in moments. Uh, I don't want to say I don't think like bad moments for sure because it's my first year in my career, and I think like maybe when I come back to player, I'm not the same player. Maybe I can play like more how I know. So pass a lot of things in, in my hair, but but the the. the the, the the thing is when you shame this this like bad pensaments for positive you know and and also when you start to working when you start to when when I when I come here to the training when I put all my my 100 percent and more uh, and this is now the result about my my working about about how how I hard training like the last the last year no. Ahora crees que uh, tú es el mismo jugador Okay, antes, do you think you're the same player now that you were before? No, obviamente soy un, un jugador más más maduro, con con una gran mentalidad, con siempre cuando pasas de unos malos momentos cambias cosas y y, y eres mejor. Uh, of course, no, I am different now. Uh, always when you when you pass like bad moments. Uh, you are different because you have more experience. Uh, you change your mind. You are more positive. Uh, and and now, if this happens, uh, you make the results. So now, for me, uh, I don't know. I feel more strong. I feel more confidence in me. Uh, and this is and this is the result about uh, in all the I don't know all all the the working and, and all the how I think. Alan, we have a few questions for you on Zoom. Our first question will go to Todd Palmer with 41 Action News. Todd, your line is open. 
Uh, hey, Alan, and Kurt, I'll have two questions here. Um, first of all, um, you know, you you come back in April. By June, you're the MLS Player of the Month. Uh, by September, you've got a new contract. Um, is there anything um, this season that you're most proud of or that uh, stands out the most to you about this journey back? And are you surprised at how quickly you found success again on the pitch? Yes, uh, of course. This is this is the uh, is is I don't know. Is the last year for me is the more difficult in my career, uh, and now sometimes it's surprise. But of course, when I speak with the, with my physios, they say me like, you know, to be surprised because you work like like a monster. You work like every day. So you come here like happy, and you want to. You want to make like, if I say like 10 repetitions, you make like 15 or 20. So this is the result about my job. And, and of course, uh, also it's, it's about, the, about the team because uh, I don't play alone. I play with, with another players. I play uh, with, my, with my, my fellas. And so this, these guys support me a lot. Also the fans uh, support me when I, when I see like the message. Uh, in the social media, always is like positive. Always like, always is like, hey, we, we can wait when you come back to play with with, with this season. So I, I don't know. This for me is motivation, and this for me uh, is like compromise because I want to be, I want to be come back like more soon in how is possible. And and I don't know. This is this is about like 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 my team, of course, uh, and I am so happy. For this year, because uh, for me it's, it's different. I, I when you say it's, it's how you say like player of the month. Um, I have a new contract for Sporting, and I am so happy. Uh, the, the the team and the coach and every everybody bring my confidence. Uh, and now this is I am so happy. This year for me is amazing. Uh, but of course, this is uh, I want to I want to I want to win. I want to win the, the MLS, the, the MLS, the champions because we have the opportunity to play the next match, the semi-final uh, with Houston, and and I want to win. This is the more important thing for me, of course. Uh, the, of course, like with the team, if I win like the champion, for me is is the best. And then speaking of the team, I mean, it's been ten days since you guys eliminated St. Louis, and it. Still another, what, 11 days until you get to play that Houston game. Um, how difficult is it to manage this three-week layoff? Um, and how do you guys keep that momentum that you had built going um, during this time off? No, I think, I think it's, it's only in the main, no? For, for us, for us it's good, I tell you the truth, because uh, we, we have time for recovery the players in, in, in injury like Danny Rosero and me the last the last two three matches I I, I play with with one pain in, in my my health so now I am 100 percent and, and and this is I think for us is is good no we, we we now I I watch how we, we train in the field and, and, and everybody's happy, everybody's excited for the next match, for the play like semifinal. So we wait for this moment. We, we are very excited uh, and we know we are very uh, like a strong team and, and we can and we want to and we, we can go, go to try to win. This is the this is the mentality for us. Our next question will go to John Lupo with Vavil. John, your line is open. Thank you. Uh, two questions for me as well. First of all, Alan, congratulations on a very well-deserved award. I wanted to ask you about doing it in the context with this group, with this franchise, with, with this set of teammates having a career high in goals in the middle of a playoff run. Can you just talk about what all of that means in, in context to what the season's been like for you guys so far of winning this award? Yes, yes, yes. I, I speak all, all the all the days, no. I will speak about the, the next match and also uh, to the to the last matches how we play, how we exchange like different things and, and we win the matches. Uh, I think for me is the very good mentality the very good mentality and, and, and also the very good organized in the last matches is for this we are now in semifinals. So always we talk about the, the next game. 
and, and how the and how them them play no the Houston. So we we are so excited for the next match. Uh, we won we won the the day is coming coming soon because we are ready. We are ready and 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 we win we want to win. Can you just also talk about that next match against Houston? What challenges they present? What you guys think you're going to have to do in order to advance to the conference final? And no, we still like we need to play like the same team in the last matches. No, of course Houston is is a strong team, and they is difficult difficult field for for play. But we we have confidence in 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 ourselves. Uh, we have very good mentality in this moment because the last matches. I think we 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 have very good job. We can, we make very good job and 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 actually, you know, we are we are ready. We are uh, focused in the in the next in the next match, and, and we are happy because and th this is the two the two phase to the season because in the first in the first part of the season we we don't think and we are now in this position, but now we are in one semi final and. And this is the more important. Our next question will go to Dylan Butler with MLSsoccer.com. Dylan, your line is open. Thanks. Um, Adan, this is obviously sporting against Houston, but um, you know the fun side matchup is, is you and, and, and Hector on the other side. Uh, what have you thought about, uh, about you know, seeing him on the other side of the field and, and the job that he's done to, to kind of help that club um, you know, raise its level and, and, and get to this point. Thank you. Yes, hello. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I, I don't talk yet with, with Hector Herrera, but this guy is, is very, very good friend. Uh, always I speak with him in the, in the Instagram, in the message. Uh, and I am happy. I am happy uh, now we play versus, versus them, you know, versus him, because he, I think... He's he's like very good player, and he's Mexican like me, and and of course uh, he's excited when you play like with another Mexican. So, but of course every uh, everybody want to win. He want to win, and me, me too. So, but the more important thing is we can make we we, we can play like the best how we know for for the team uh, and win, but. For sure, maybe I talk with him because we need to bet something uh, about the winner uh, about the match. But I don't know. No, this is very good friend, and, and I am happy to play versus him. Our next question will go to Gerald Bentley with Fired Up Network. Gerald, your line is open. Alan, congratulations on the award. I just want to ask you, how much better is Sporting in position for this playoff run after the drive the team had to make? to get to the playoffs. You've been playing intense soccer now almost the whole season. Yes, I think we, we exchange the, the mentality. Uh, and of course, the level for, for, for us is, is like minimum to maximum, no? and it's like progressive. So now we are in different position. Now we are not the same team when we start to the season. Now we are more focused. Now we are more strong. We are more... We are more put attention in the matches. I think uh, it's for this we win the, the last the, the last matches, no? The last like with with San Luis, and and, all, uh, and I don't know. The expectative for us is is um, high, and and we want we want to win this match. We we know we are a very good team and a strong team, and now we are ready for the for the semifinals. Our next question will go to Fernando Ceballos with Fox Sports. Fernando, your line is open. Hola, Alan. Qué gusto verte bien recuperado y con, y con el premio. Preguntarte eh, directamente, porque en México hubo, hubo mucha especulación al respecto. Eh, estabas a punto de terminar contrato, ya renovaste, te quedas dos años más en Sporting, pero ¿te buscó algún club de, de México en ese periodo? Se habló mucho de Chivas. Re ¿Realmente te buscaron? ¿Hubo algún acercamiento formal? Y si así fue, ¿por qué al final no, no se dio? Gracias, Alan. ¿Qué tal, Fernando? Sí, bueno, gracias, gracias ahí por la felicitación. Y, y bueno, sí, contento, contento de poder estar acá en el, en el equipo. Eh, renové, como lo mencionas, tres años. Eh, y, y bueno, sí, claro, hubo acercamientos cuando normalmente así pasa, cuando 
un jugador no ha renovado, tiene, tiene diferentes propuestas, eh, más en, en, en México, que, que bueno, me conocen y, y por realmente los resultados que he dado allá. Eh, sí, estuvieron en equipos contacto, pero, pero bueno, al final les dejé claro ¿no? en el tema de, de que si Sporting eh, me ofrecía un... Obviamente le iba a dar la prioridad a ellos, ¿no? Por el tema de, de, del apoyo que me dieron, por el tema del respaldo de mi lesión. Y, y bueno, al final así fue. Y, y fue una propuesta donde me, realmente no la podía desaprovechar. Una propuesta que aseguraba tres años de mi vida. Y, y obviamente me sentí con el compromiso de, de aceptarla, ¿no? Por, por todo, como lo mencioné, por todo el apoyo y el cariño que, que me han dado. Entonces, nada, contento, contento. Realmente ahora de poder, de poder estar en una semifinal y, y que estoy cerca por ahí de poder ser campeón. Eh, entonces ojalá y pueda darles esa recompensa ¿no? a, a por, este, por este gran esfuerzo que hicieron en, en poderme retener. Y, y bueno, eh, sin duda contento. ¿no? Our next question will be Hector Lazeri with Claro Sports. Hector, your line is open. Hola Alan, ¿qué tal? Hector Lazeri de, de Claro Sports. Primero que nada, también felicitarte. Y después, dos preguntas. La primera, no jugaste el primer mes. La recuperación tardó quizás hasta más de lo que se esperaba, eso de 14 meses. ¿Te imaginabas recuperar tu nivel así de pronto y vaya a ser ahora el, el jugador o el comeback del año en la MLS? Y segundo, ¿qué, ¿cuáles son tus siguientes objetivos después de, de conseguir este premio? Sí, la verdad que, que bueno, esta, esta lesión es así, ¿no? Fue, fue una lesión complicada. Eh, la realidad, me habían comentado que era de un año, un poquito más. Eh, se llegó a tardar un, un poco, sí, por el, el tema de, de, de que, bueno, por momentos me sentía bien, de repente mal. Eh, por ahí se me inflamaba un poco, no estaba acostumbrado al, al contacto y todo, pero, pero es parte de, ¿no? Ya después me empecé a sentir mucho mejor y... Y bueno, lo importante fue que nunca bajé los brazos, siempre trabajé, siempre luché. Siempre, sabía que en cualquier momento estaba cerca el regreso y, y, y tenía que ayudar a mi equipo ¿no? a, a, a lograr los objetivos que, que, nos, que nos pusimos al, al, al principio del torneo. Y, y bueno, la verdad que, que gracias a Dios pude, pude colaborar con, con, con goles, con triunfos por ahí, eh, junto con todos mis compañeros que nos pusieron y nos tuvieron siempre con, con esa esperanza ¿no? de poder entrar a los playoffs hasta el final. Y, y fue así, ¿no? Ahora estamos en una semifinal eh, y, y pronto eh, pode, podremos jugarla y, y, y poder buscar ese campeonato, ¿no? En, en lo personal, realmente, sinceramente, no, no te lo imaginas hasta que ya lo vives. Eh, pero no, no es sorpresa, sino es recompensa a todo el trabajo, a todo el sacrificio, a todo lo que uno va realizando y, y que todo esto siempre de los malos momentos sacamos lo mejor de nosotros, ¿no? Esto es, es un claro ejemplo de, de, de lo bien que, que, que me mentalicé para estos momentos y ahora que estoy aquí voy a buscar este campeonato, contento por ganar el, el, el player comeback del año, pero, pero esto no termina aquí, ahora estoy buscando mi semifinal, la semifinal y, y quiero ganarla. Our next question will go to Aiden Manzano with Telemundo KC. Aiden, your line is open. Hola, Alan. Buenas tardes y felicidades por el premio Comeback. Eh, dos preguntas. Preguntarte si crees que estás en la, en la mejor versión de ti como jugador. Y bueno, con los argumentos y reconocimientos que has tenido en los últimos meses, eh, si te gustaría ser llamado en algún momento de nueva cuenta a la Selección Nacional Mexicana. Gracias. ¿Qué tal? Muchas gracias. Eh, pues mira, la verdad es que nunca sabemos cuándo es nuestro mejor momento, porque siempre podemos dar más, siempre te puede ir mejor. Eh, yo creo que paso por un buen momento y, y me siento contento después de, de una lesión eh, que tuve complicada ahora reponerme tan rápido y, y por ahí ayudar a mi equipo a, a estar en la semifinal es algo que, que me emociona y me entusiasma y, y bueno, me motiva también estamos ahí buscando el campeonato que es lo más importante y, y claro, ojalá y se nos pueda dar no uh, ahora, claro, siempre Mientras esté jugando siempre va a existir y, y, y para mí eh, volver a la selección, eso está más que claro, representar a mi país siempre va a ser un orgullo, pero bueno, eso no, no depende de mí, eh, yo seguiré haciendo lo que me corresponde, yo creo que los resultados y, y, y los momentos van a hablar por sí solo y, y bueno, me, ahora me enfoco en ello, eh, estoy en la semifinal y ojalá y, y pueda lograr ese título que tanto he deseado desde que llegué acá. 
Our last question for Alan will go to Pedro Zamora with SID TV. Pedro, your line is open. Pedro, a quick reminder to unmute your device. Ah, perdón. Alan, buenas tardes. ¿Qué, qué, Alan, ¿Qué versión de Alan veremos en esta semifinal? La primera. Y la segunda, ahorita lo decías en inglés, ¿qué has hablado con Héctor? ¿Han tenido ahí un pique de, de jugadores mexicanos? Eh, ¿Qué tal? Pues bueno, obviamente trataré de, de hacerlo lo mejor, ¿no? Lo mejor que pueda, el, yo creo que para, para el beneficio de mi equipo. Lo importante es ganar este partido que viene para estar en la final de conferencias. Eso es, eso es lo que deseo y, y lo que deseamos todos como equipo. Y, y obviamente ojalá y pueda colaborar con goles para, para ayudar a mi equipo ¿no? a avanzar a la siguiente ronda. Y, y bueno, de, de lo otro, no, 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 he, no he tenido todavía la oportunidad de hablar con él, pero siempre nos estamos mensajeando y todo seguro que, que cuando esté próximo al partido nos, nos desearemos lo mejor, nos saludaremos, ahí hablaremos un poco y... Y bueno, contento, contento de, de enfrentarme contra él. Es un gran amigo desde hace mucho tiempo. Eh, compartimos justo el vestidor. Eh, estuvimos juntos en la selección y, y la verdad que, que me pone contento enfrentarlo porque es un gran jugador y, y siempre eh, compartir cancha, eh, aunque sea de rivales con, tu, con otro mexicano, es algo que, que te pone muy, muy feliz. Alan, thank you very much for the time today. Congratulations. Thank you.